<laughs> I forgot. Uh, yeah. Wow. I just had a brain lapse. You know what's great? Um, I can't find any of my Star Wars shirts. That's not what's great. I just realized that like this part of my bed's not made like right here. It looks messy as shit. Do I care? No. Also, I got up to pee because I just did like, most of these back to back to back. It's been like 40 minutes. And like I farted on my way out and I came back and this leather chair, man, that the fart just stayed. I think I just ruined this this chair from from Techni. God, wait. I don't know the way directions work. From Techni Sport. Use code VII to save 10%. That's a shameless plug. Let's put this thing back on so I have some support here. I'm struggling. Am I going to edit any of that out in the first minute? No. Hey, nerds, Jerry here. We're about to react to uh, Star Wars Episode 2 Attack of the Clones. Okay. The original trailer. Why is it being so bitchy? Ooh, look at that. Dun, dun. The Wizard of Oz. The Aluminum Falcon, baby. I will not let this republic be I split will not two. let the republic will not fail. If they do, there aren't enough Jedi to protect the republic. We're keepers of the peace, not soldiers. Keepers of the peace as Obi-Wan slaughters somebody in a bar. You know I don't like it when you do that. Sorry, Master. I forgot you don't like flying. Well, you've lost him. If you'll excuse me. I hate it when he does that. Anakin. Don't do anything without first consulting either myself or the Council. You don't need guidance, Anakin. I see you becoming the greatest of all Jedi. Dude. It's so good. Oh! Not this movie, by the way. The manipulation of Anakin, right? Just makes me so happy. Oh. Boy has exceptional skills. His abilities have made him arrogant. Excuse me. I'm in charge of security here, my lady. Hayden Christensen, I'm not going to lie. My personal opinion, he struggled acting in this movie. Some of his lines are a little not there. Um, but he just fits so good, man. He's such a good Anakin. I don't care what you guys say. Episode 3, he redeems himself 100%. I mean, not really redeems himself because he turns to the dark. You guys get what I'm saying. I never understood what the f that thing was, but it's cool. Django Fett. We must stop them before they're ready. Your clones are very impressive. They'll do their job well. Blast! That's why I hate flying. The dialogue, man. This is a crisis. France. I did love the sound of those things blowing up. That. That thing. Must vote the Chancellor emergency powers. As my first act, I will create a grand army of the Republic to counter the increasing threats of the Separatists. You know, I remember watching these as a kid. And of course, when you watch movies as a kid, you don't really grasp onto the story too much. Did we all know, other than knowing who the actor was or if that was around then, that Palpatine was going to be the Emperor? Was the Emperor ever referred to as Darth Sidious or Palpatine and like... The original movies now that I think about it, I don't know. Was that the big twist? Because we knew Anakin was Darth Vader. Scale war since the formation of the Republic. You must join me, Obi Wan. Darth Tyrannus, dude. Count Duke Christopher Lee's Count Dooku has to be again another top villain. And together, we will destroy the Sith. The dark side clouds everything. In the grave danger, you are. R2-D2 flying was not a good sight. Begun this Clone War has. I don't know why do they why do they put the why they put Darth Vader's breathing in this I mean I get it because of Anakin but like it makes you think he'll be in the movie he's not why am I talking like this anyways um 
the high points from Attack of the Clones. First of all, the trailer, again, spoiler warning, I guess, Jesus. They show Mace Windu's purple lightsaber, which was cool. Uh, I think that would have been a cool reveal in the movie. The scene of him running is him about to cut Jango Fett's head off, which imagine seeing that as a kid. Um, dude. The high points from Attack of the Clones. Mace Windu's purple lightsaber. Okay. Mace Windu in general. Mace Windu's a badass. Count Dooku. The Count Dooku fight. I think I think that's that's <laughs> I think that's about it. Um, the downsides, the entire rest of the movie. It's just not good. Personal opinion. Some people love it. I I hate it. I'm not, I'm not a fan of it, to say the least. I'll watch it anytime it's on. It's Star Wars. I don't, I don't care about that. I just, I'm not a fan. I don't, I'm not like, oh, that was an exceptional, exceptional, exceptional. Jeez, I can't even speak. Star Wars fan. That's me. Exceptional movie. Um, the best part of the entire movie is Yoda. Right? Like Yoda coming in to fight Dooku and flipping and stuff. Everybody's like, yo, this man can use the force to be moving around like that. Okay, brother. The best part, uh, Jango Fett clone army. I, I enjoyed that angle that they're all made from a bounty hunter. They're all made from a Mandalorian, even though somebody said, I think George Lucas said that the Fets aren't Mandalorians, which is a giant smack in the face to everybody if that's true, but whatever. That's Attack of the Clones. That's honestly it. I'm done with the video. I'm over it. I want to do Revenge of the Sith. Watching the beginning of the manipulation of Anakin Skywalker by Palpatine, though, is actually pretty interesting. Also, Anakin's mom dies in this movie, which I always thought was in Revenge of the Sith. And my man killed everybody in that town. And rightfully so. Rightfully so. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, drop a like. Subscribe to the channel. Video should be popping up for this playlist and the previous one, which would be episode six or whatever order I'm going to put these in. Just click, click the video, watch the other ones. <laughs> but as always, check back for gameplays, commentaries, news, and updates. Later, nerds.